what does the Tibetan Book of the Dead describe? And is it the best source for understanding bodily death? And my reply is, the Tibetan Book of the Dead, the Bardo Total, describes the essential features of the Buddhist afterlife. Almost immediately upon death, one will perceive the primary clear light of utmost consciousness. Described in the work, as quoted from David Lynch's TV series, Twin Peaks, more or less thus, Leland, the time has come for you to seek the path. Your soul has set you face to face with the clear light, and you are now about to experience it in all its reality, wherein all things are like the void and cloudless sky, and the naked, spotless intellect is like a transparent vacuum without circumference or center. Leland, in this moment, know yourself and abide in that state. Look to the light, Leland. Find the light. Into the light. Into the light. End quote. If the soul clings to the body and cannot allow its ego, as we understand it in the West, to dissolve into oneness with this primary clear light, then the soul will likely enter into the bardo realm of reincarnation, defined by the six lokas, or types of being one can reincarnate as. One, a deity. Two, a jealous god, three, a human, four, an animal, five, a hungry ghost, or six, a demon. The longer a soul lingers in the material physical realm after its bodily death, the lower it sinks in this bardo realm. And it continues to reincarnate forgetting its past karmic lessons with each death and rebirth indefinitely. Finally, in the last bardo realm, between death and rebirth, the soul is plagued by visions of wrathful deities that erase its last life's memories. With or without the bardo realm of reincarnation, The distinction of the primary clear light being the first experience a soul has after its body dies sets the Tibetan bardo total apart from its Egyptian counterpart, the book of coming forth into the clear light of day. In the Egyptian book of the dead, a soul immediately proceeds to the experience of the weighing of the soul as soon as their body dies and may only proceed to the island of Osiris by crossing the Amduat, the Egyptian river Styx, following this event. Insofar as the island of Osiris may be the closest proximal similarity to the Buddhist primary clear light bardo, both being the realm of the utmost consciousness, this distinction of which event comes first the light or the judgment following death remains massively significant. 